Hey everybody, this is Rob from the Tender Consequences. Today we're taking part in the Bikers Against Child Abuse, otherwise known as Bacchus 100 Mile Ride. Let's take the video of the ride, compress it, and run it while we talk to all these people. Let's put it here down here over here we're gonna put it somewhere all right that way this video isn't two hours long so I had some sponsors for this ride I want to thank them straight up outright thank you Terry thank you Brandon thank you Josh thank you John Maxwell thank you for supporting Baca and and what Baca does here uh, bless y'all I'm talking to Noodles, Baca member, Extreme Awesomeness. How long have you been in Baca? Uh, patched in last August. That's awesome, that's awesome. What's your uh, favorite part about being in Baca? What do you take, get the most out of? Seeing the smiles from the children. It's, uh, it's amazing, man, when they've been going through so much and struggling and, and yeah. you get to be there for them and when they start showing that, that they can be a child again it's amazing and it's just yeah it's a very grateful no that's know, awesome feeling. that's a, that's fantastic that's fantastic if someone was interested in joining baka what would you tell them come on let's ride <laughs> all right <laughs> thanks brother yes sir all right we are at extreme rider halfway on our trip 50 miles you can wave <laughs> All right, guys, this is Brick, Baca member. Brick, how long you been in Baca? I've been in Baca a little over two years now. That's awesome, brother. What is it about Baca that you enjoy the most? So what I enjoy the most about Baca is just the level of camaraderie and friendship. It's a sense of family, and we're out with a purpose, with kids, helping them get better and do everything great. That's awesome, brother. So we're doing this 100-mile ride uh, with Baca today, but... Hope, I was hoping you'd tell me a little bit, what's so special about this 100 mile wire? What is it that, that makes this really unique? So, what's unique about this is we are doing this ride at the same time around the world with every other chapter in Baca. Everybody's out together right now on every continent with the exception of Antarctica. <laughs> and that is our level of community and commitment to our cause. And that's what makes this special. Man, that's awesome, brother. Appreciate you. Anytime. Thank you. All right, then. There's Corinne. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, we're here with Tucci. He like, he like She's uh, one of the original members of Founders, the Mount Chiha Baca chapter. Tucci, how long have you been in Baca? I have been with the mission since 2014. September 2014. What, what is it about the mission in Baca that's kept you around for so long? What is that inspired for? The children. I mean, to, to work with the children and to, to meet them on that first time and they're scared and closed down and then when we show up on the level one, we leave and there's a smile. Or we get through that court and that testimony and that smile and that child is just not scared. That child has got its life back and, you know, they're able to, to resume um, semi-normal after all the trauma that they've been through. But it's just being able to help that child know that they've got support. That's awesome. And a bunch of ugly looking pipers. <laughs> That's incredible. Now I know on this ride a lot of people have donated and supported. I know I had even people who weren't even bikers uh, donating to this. So what? You know, people say, oh, you donate to Bach, and that's usually enough, right, because of, of who we are and, and what we represent. But, but what is some of that money going to? What do some of the people well, know that their money is going towards when they donate? Ev every penny of this money goes right back into our children. It goes right back into the mission, whether it be um, purchasing uh, trifolds that we hand out to people, letting them know about the mission, or if it's getting the things for that hero on that yeah. first level, on the level one, the, the cut, they get their own personal cut, they get a bottle of blankets, wow. they get a bag full of goodies, and so that is part of the help. And then we have a Christmas party where all of our heroes come together and we give them gifts and we feed them and we have just the best time. And then we also have other events like our back to school fling that we're getting ready and they'll have back to school bags 
with supplies for back to school. Um, we recently had a um, big spring fling party where we had water balloons, and chalk bombs, and hamburgers, and hot dogs, and just lots of fun. So we are always trying to think of new things to do with our kids, but um, every bit of this money goes right back to them because they're the reason why we do what we do. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. So we just got back and I've just been sitting here thinking about the ride today and everything. And again, I just want to give a real special shout out to uh, our personal sponsors for this ride today. Uh, Terry, Brandon, Josh, and of course John Maxwell. Thank you guys so much for supporting uh, Baca, uh, for supporting me and, and everything we've been doing. So. Thank you. I also want to give a, a shout out to everyone around the world today who participated or supported a, a Baca ride. Like uh, like it was said, everyone in Baca, all the Baca chapters at some point this weekend uh, were encouraged to do a 100 mile ride. COVID, some of them might not be able to, but, but those that could did. And if, if you were a participant or a supporter, thank you so much for that. Taking care of these kids, empowering these kids, I mean, that's that's the most important thing. So to be able to do that, even if it's just a quick, easy ride around the state, I think that's awesome. So thank you very much. If, if you're curious to learn more about BACA or what Bikers Against Child Abuse is all about, uh, putting all the links down below, please go to the website, uh, look up your local chapter, shoot an email hey you know how can I support if I'm interested in porting or get more information or anything like that that'd be really awesome if that was something you were interested in again the links are below and uh, as always guys keep the rubber side down and I'll see you next time